right, fighthype.com here with the WBC undefeated super featherweight champion, Oscar Valdez. Oscar, man, first of all, thanks for giving us this fight. These are the fights we dream of in boxing. Um, any, any, what, what about make, having this fight happen? Because for a while, people seem to think maybe you'd fight Emmanuel Navarrete and then this fight happens. Could you just walk us through getting here, getting to this we fight? We never really agreed to Navarrete. You know, the, the fight was offered uh, a couple of times and we denied it. We, just, we didn't really want that fight because there was no win to that fight. You know, he, um, Navarrete is a tough fighter, but, you know, the fans wouldn't really uh, appreciate that type of fight. You know, the fans wanted to see Shakur fight for a long time and that's what we were as well, and we denied it. We were trying to push the Shakur fight until it, until it happened. It happened. So that's that's one thing that, that we're really excited. We're all the social media talk. They're saying that we're running. And that's all. That was all fake. That was all. That was all lies. And we have always wanted to fight as far as you know. I always think my, well, every time they mentioned, I said let's do it. Since the first time the the, the, the fight ended with uh, since the first fight that Concesia. No, the drop with the, with Brichette back in 2020 when he mentioned my name, I said let's do it. But the bigger prize was the WBC belt, so I was probably stay with that. But you know, now was the time. Now was the time. All that talking's out, and, and let's, let's get this fight going. What because makes what makes this the right time for this fight for you? Um, it's just this is the right moment. You know, Shakur's going going up. Uh, he has that belt. I have his belt, and you know, let's let's unify. Let's unify. You see guys like like Terrence Crawford, like, like, like Taylor, he's like Tyson Fury. And you see them carry all the belts, and it just, it just motivates you. It motivates you to, to not just have one belt, but let's try to get all the belts. You know, and yeah, because you know, back to talk about the fight happening, Stevenson felt it, it was that public pressure that made you take the fight, but that you, it sounds like you're saying that's false. You were had your sights set on this unification oh, yeah, all along. And also, but it, does, it does have to do with, do with, the, with the fans, you know, for sure, 100%. Because the fans want this fight. I was I was uh, pushed to say, okay, well, I want I want to make that fight happen because the fans want it. And I owe myself to the fans. You know, the, the fans want to fight. And it's too good. If, the fight, if the fans really wanted the Navarrete fight, they didn't really fight Navarrete. If the fans wanted to fight, you know, uh, whoever out there, whatever guys out there, then I'm willing to fight whoever the fans want me to fight. That's what true champions do, right, Oscar? Yeah, we, that's what we want. You know, we want to be recognized as the best, and uh, we don't want to beat a fighter, and then people say, you, you got to fight out this guy. So we just, you know, we just concentrated on, on taking it step by step. The fans wanted this fight, and that's why we had to make it. You know, I just thinking stylistically about this fight, a lot of people seem to think it's it's his fight on the outside boxing. It's your fight if you can get inside. Is is that how you see it? And how tough watching Shakur is it to, to get him to fight on the inside and, and not just, make it a boxing match? It's just a chess game, you know. Uh, I'm not expecting in there to go in there toe to toe with a war like uh, we're like we're used to seeing. You know, I'm expecting a chess game. You know, I seriously doubt that Shakur's gonna stay in there and try to um, try to bang with me. Um, that's what I think. But you know what I what I do think is gonna happen is gonna be more of a chess game. Who's cool, the smarter fighter with the ring IQ? Whoever's uh, taking advantage of the ring is gonna become the the winner that night. Did he show you anything with his last performance against Herring? He look, the, the he look, oh yeah, he looked great. He looked great. I, I didn't expect him to to stop Jermaine Herring, and he did it. So uh, Shakur is definitely the lead fighter that we have to beat right now.